This is our AT220 possum trap, rat trap. It's the only possum trap that will catch rats. It's got two kill zones in it. We do the rats using a kill bar, like, quite like the Dock 200, and the possums are killed in the keyhole. They're triggered with a photo eye. That enables the rat to trigger a possum trap. They don't have to be strong, they just gotta trigger the photo eye. The trap is rebated automatically every day or after every kill. And here we have a liquid bait. We have here, it's like a heavy oil that also drips out onto the ramp, which is above it, which is, acts as a pre-feed. We don't get them the first night, we'll get them the second night. This is our possum, comes in, The trap will reset a hundred times and last six months. The target is 12 months. With a bit of help from Predator Free, we we'll, should achieve 12 months battery life and still do the 100 kills. I like to make things work. I like fixing things. I like making things automatic. I enjoy that. When you hear of the volunteers having to scrape out miles of dead possum that's been hanging in a trap for four weeks, they're not very pleasant. These things don't have to do that. This is the battery layout we're proposing in Wakatani. Got an inwards goods and dispatch. We've got a nice big area there for testing. Up to six or eight workstations for assembly staff. Predator Free are helping us in this area here. That'll be CNC equipment, a bit of assembly automation. Storage area, office, smoker room. They do a heck of a lot of conservation up there. Got Kiwi come right into the, into, uh, the houses.